Hello, it's uh, Symbol here, and today I'm going to look at one of my caches up this hill. And I'll show you the going up a hill from the church down there. Look, and we're going uphill. I'm completely out of breath, but what I've done with this cache, because it was muggled, um, I've replaced it in a different position. Uh, the first cache was Geocacher's Rest and uh, Magnetic was the clue. I'll show you why that was, but um, I think a lot of people sit on here I don't know, their fingers must have been wandering around and spotted the, not spotted, felt the cache or saw it. But now I've put it somewhere even more, more clever. Let's see if you can find it. This is very, very steep. It's very deceptive on the, can you see the angle from there? Let's see how clever this is. Or oh, see how clever you think it is. Right. Well, there you are. Geocacher's rest. That's the easy bit. Let's get up to it and get me breath. Right. Right, the beeper should beep here. On my, on my GPS. Right. It was a favourite walk of somebody that put a bench here, you can't read it now, in memory of something, a friend. Oh. A friend, can you see? I can read friend. Can you read, see a friend? And member of of Brinton's Walking Club and the title was Geocaching Geocacher's Rest if you sit down here look can you see that? see the church uh, the River Seven in the background and we're in between Bewdley and Stourport in Worcestershire England UK and the clue was magnetic so as you can see can you see these little holes there and there's one down there there's actually two down there can you see one two and there was another one there another one there and there's another one down there and that's where I where the muggles found it. I suppose if you sat here for quite a time you'd find it. It's got a ribbon here now and I was thinking of putting the cache there and then I was going to put it, hide it behind there or there or call it a right elbow arm look put it underneath there I was thinking of putting it underneath underneath the magnetic bit so they wouldn't see it too easy but then I decided no, I just need a better place and the clue is, I haven't made it up yet because um, I'm going home, I've just um, hidden it now. See what you think or um, comment below what, you sh what I should give the clue and uh, if that um, gets the most favourites or likes. Um, I will use that as a clue but my my idea of the clue was uh, take a rest on the geocacher's seat or take a seat on geocacher's rest feel feel on your right for rotting for mossy rot. 
and put ribbon in or something. Somebody's actually put that ribbon there. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's in memory of the person. And they've left that there with some uh, uh, flowers stuck in there and the flowers have gone. But can you guess where it is yet? I've got to think of a better clue than that. Yeah, I think you've got it. Look, there's the mossy, uh, the rotten moss, and there's a, a camo there. I put in a camo, um, one of these micro camos, um, sample tubes, and I've put some uh, camo, um, what's it called? That camouflage tape. I made it look like a leaf look, I've cut it in the shape of a leaf. And see I've got some fishing wire as well, because a lot of people they there, the fishing uh there's there look, is it called wire fishing? I don't go fishing so what would you call that fishing um um don't know what it's called, line. Fishing line, that's it. Because there are a lot of people have been saying oh they lose the tops because they're so small, but I made the top bigger by uh, put in the camo on there and then I've added the, um, the fishing line to the top and then I've taped it round there and put the other part of the fishing line in there and if we could open it up can I just put you down and you can have a look at the scenery while I just open it up can you see everything there can you see me can you see me and screw it off look See? Can you see that? I'm not sure where you are on the camera. Is that focusing? I don't know if it's high or low. And there, I've put a nail in there. I'll go up and down because I'm not sure if you're in focus or not. Can you see there's a nail there? So it's easy to put your nail. Your nail can get the nail. <laughs> see how dirty I am today because I've been <laughs> rooting around trying to find hiding place and there you are there's there's a new uh, geocaching log can you see that I'm gonna put because I'm moving around it's only because I don't know where you are at the moment perhaps I should pick you up and have a make sure that you are focused there you are if you've never played this before this is uh, a geo geocaching game and you can uh, join us online at geocaching.com this is a game please and um, you, if you're the first one to find you can put first to find name and date that's all you put sign it with your geocaching name and date and a lot of my uh, geocaches have got over nearly a hundred now um, I uh, save these when they're full but this has um, been muggled but when they fill up I save, save them if they haven't been muggled and that goes in there and I've put the nail because it's easy to roll roll it up I'll put you back down so I can roll it up it's easier to roll it's easier to pull it look can you see I'm going up and down again just because I'm not sure where the focus point is but you can pull it tight like that and then pop it in there pop it in there look easy pop in screw on I put some mud actually around this. It was, I thought it's too obvious that it was a camo or some tape. Now I'm going to put that back. Uh, I'll keep looking down the hill in case somebody comes. And then that, I'll show you. Will slide in there. I could leave that. Even I th don't think that's noticeable. I'm going to put some more mud on. There, look push it tight in there and then drop that on there nobody would think of getting that would they I don't know if it's that way or that way now there you are what do you think if you can uh, suggest um, a clue in the comments below I'll be really grateful because I'm not very good on uh, clues and things like that anyway this was um, symbol and I hope you enjoyed that everyone. Look at that. Somebody's, I think they're cutting wood down there. I think they're thinning some of the, the wood down there. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. I hope you can uh, subscribe. 
uh, comment below. Uh, what else can you do? Oh, click the little bell and that'll give you um, a heads up that I've uh, done a new video and I've uploaded another video. It's 2020 now and I'll start doing some more uh, uh, YouTube videos for you. So happy geocaching everyone. Get out, get out there in the great outdoors. It's great for fitness. Brilliant. Probably one of the best hobbies there is. Okay, bye for now everyone. Bye.